Yesterday, a group of millionaire Kool-Aid drunk swift boaters, known as the Republican Jewish Coalition, came out with an ad attacking Speaker of the House Nancy Pelosi. So, let me get this straight. In between the Sunday meeting of Republican representatives Frank Wolf, Joe Pitts, and Robert Adderholt with Syrian President Bashar Assad in Damascus, in the meeting with California Republican Daryl Issa, where Assad and Issa discuss, quote, the mechanisms and means that must be available to build a solid U.S.-Syrian relationship. Nancy Pelosi joins in the talks and is immediately swift-boated. My question is, does this Republican administration think that the middle class is so stupid that we can't see blatant hypocrisy thrown in our faces? Thanks, oil barons. Us poor working people are just so dumb. We can't see that the car salesman trying to sell us that special undercoating that'll protect us from those impending terrorist IEDs. Thinks that lying to the American people is just the way the game is played. Because we're just too simple-minded to determine our own future. Could someone please tell me why we're still in Iraq? We went there to uh, get rid of weapons of mass destruction. There were none. Mission accomplished. Get rid of Saddam Hussein. Mission accomplished. Create a democratic government. Mission accomplished. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, I forgot what this week's line of bull was. If there's anybody else left out there that thinks that we should destroy our army so George W. Imperial Bush can save what's left of his two faces and continue on fighting someone else's civil war, I ask you this. Which side are we supposed to root for? The Shiites and the Iranians Mahmoud Ahmadinejad and the, those guys? were the Sunnis, like Osama bin Laden and Saddam Hussein. Could you guys make up your mind? Because I really would like to know. <laughs>